And with that, you can now say you have officially experienced Gypsy Jazz. It's just one of the many world music styles represented in the City of Irving's International Concert Series, free to the public. We ain't got nothing to worry about. We won't be doing time. This is the second concert in the city's series of musical events set for different times and different venues across Irving. And while Gypsy Jazz is the musical feature for this day, reggae, polka, salsa, and many other international flavors are also on the menu. We're just hoping that it's a cultural experience for everybody involved. And what we're trying to do is locate the concerts at different venues in Irving so that we can have a mass appeal to the entire community. This concert entertained a weekday lunch audience along the canal of Las Colinas Urban Center. The Wojak family of Irving found it a perfect excuse to set aside their family gardening business and spread out for a picnic lunch. It's a great, great, beautiful day and we like being outside. We thought we would picnic, so it's a good opportunity to be together as a family. Whistle Stop Plaza serves as another venue in the concert series. It kicked off with this recent polka performance to entertain a Friday night crowd. The series is part of the city's increased focus on special events, meant to give current residents a way to have fun and maybe even draw in some new residents. And wherever the concert, that's where you'll find Patty Lee. I come to every concert they have as long as I'm not encumbered somewhere else. I love the variety of music they offer. It's always in fun venues. You can get up and dance. You can pack a lunch and come and enjoy it. And the music, as you can hear, is absolutely awesome. Was it standing room only on this day? Mm, not exactly. But city organizers say that's OK. It's a first time event. Ideally, we wanted higher numbers, but we know and realize that you have to start somewhere. So we're OK with it because honestly, Phil, everyone here has enjoyed it. And by word of mouth, will continue to grow every year. And should that word of mouth take off, the Wojak family says they'd be just fine to share their picnic space. I'm Jolene DeVito for City Source.